online. I buy everything online because I I don't like deal, I don't like like customer service like like deal with people out in public who just like like they just give like too many and you like, yo man, you gotta bring down your level. <laughs> like just why do you care about this job so much? This job don't care about you. Let it go. I got into it with this lady, like I got, I got escorted, I was at home, I was in LA, I got escorted out of Chase Bank, out of a Chase Bank by security, because like, she made me feel, like, we had an argument, and she made me feel like I was being an angry black dude, but I'm like, man, just, like, just, just be a person with me, just like, make me feel like you understand my point, and she didn't, she, oh man, okay, here's what happened, okay, here's what happened. <laughs> Makes me upset when I talk about this. Makes me upset. So a friend of mine named Jesse needed some money, he had, like, he had, he had some medical shit piled up, he had like medical bills because he had surgery on his shoulder, not from smoking weed. <laughs> he had like this cancer in the shoulder, right? He's cancer in the shoulder, and like, uh, like cells or like lymph nodes or something. I don't, I'm not a doctor. So like, he, he got, he got, you know, got it removed, so he's doing fine, but his medical bill's piled up, and he goes, man, I could really use like 500 bucks to help me pay for, the, for this bill. I go, no problem. So I go to my bank, I grab about 500 bucks, and I go back to Chase, and it's like, it's like end of the month, so the, so the line is long, and I wait like 20 minutes, and I would do the whole, you know, this whole thing, the, the, uh, the maze, you gotta wait in, right? <laughs> So I do that whole thing for like 20 minutes, and I get to the front, and the lady's like, come on. I'm like, yes, I won. And I get to the glass. I'm like, yes, ma'am, here's 500 bucks uh, cash. I just need to give this to my friend Jesse. And I put his account number on, from my phone up on the glass. And she goes, oh, I'm sorry, sir, but uh, we don't take cash. <laughs> what you talking about? And she goes, oh, she was like, sir, could you not use that kind of language? This is a family environment. Oh, I was like, oh, I'm sorry, I apologize. It, it, it sounded to me. <laughs> like, like through the glass. <laughs> that, that, that you just said that y'all don't take cash. <laughs> sir, that's correct. What you talking about? Sir, can you relax? I'm not, I'm not gonna relax because cause you, I, you just told me that a bank don't take money. That doesn't sound kind of awkward to you. She goes, we've had problems with money laundering. I'm like, money laundering? This is $500, it's $500. You think, oh, you think that's my plan? You think my plan is to go up the coast depositing the small amounts from branch to branch until I take over the system? You think that's my diabolical plan, Brenda, huh? <laughs> Sir, calm, calm, calm down, because you can't just change your business model. You can't, that's the only reason why we know y'all, okay? That's all you do. You can't just stop doing what we know you for, okay? <laughs> like, if you, went, if you went to McDonald's tomorrow, and you're like, give me two double cheeseburgers and a small fry, and they're like, oh, we only sell bicycles and shovels now. You'd be like... <laughs> I was here last week, I don't know. <laughs> like, if y'all came in here tonight to see a show, and it was a, it was a <laughs> casket on the stage. <laughs> Sorry guys, no show tonight, but pay your respects and have a drink. <laughs> so she... <laughs> so Brenda just, Brenda goes, hey, I can't take your cash, but you can give us a check. I go, a ch you won't take my real money. <laughs> Will you take a, ch you'll take a check? I mean, I've seen Catch Me If You Can't. Leonardo DiCaprio was making checks in the bathtub <laughs> in the 60s. And you won't take my, act. you know what? All right, I'm gonna get you, I'm gonna get you, I'm gonna get you a check because it's not, it's about Jesse. It's not about, it's not about me and you. But before I go, before I go, I need you to tell me that this is stupid. <laughs> Sir, it is the policy of Chase Bank. No, 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 shut the <laughs> up, Brenda. <laughs> I don't give a damn about the policy of Chase Bank. I want you as a person to identify with me and, let, and just let me know that a bank not taking money is stupid. <laughs> and I don't care how you tell me, you could bend down and say through this little trough that I, that I could have put this money through. <laughs> At this point, Brenda hits the button on me. Now it's two security guards behind me. They lift me up by my shoulders up under here and they push me out of two double doors onto the sidewalk as I'm screaming, but it's for cancer. <laughs> Now, the only reason, the reason why I bring it up, the reason why I tell y'all this is I, if you're ever in L.A. and you're in the Valley and you got like five or ten minutes and you see Chase Bank on the corner, <laughs> I would love for you to stop in, ask for Brenda, <laughs> and tell her that Tone Bell says, <laughs> you.